Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Being Mona. Thank you for always watching my videos. I really appreciate you. Yes. Today on my video, I'll I'll talk about skills you need to to know to make it in Africa. Yeah. Prima, it's about what I have experienced. Yeah, I'm an African Kenyan to be precise. I'm living in the countryside at the moment in Kisi County. I'll talk a little bit about how they greet when you are here. Greetings like the basic terms used the name of the village. It's called Nemanagu Village. Mostly it's raining. So Get our main car shops here is banana and tea. Yes, let's talk about the soft skills you might need here. Even me, I need them because even though I'm African, I also need them, and it's good too. So, one of them you, you may need some craftiness because sometimes some information you may need. Because some of the information may not be neatly laid down on the website. You may also need to go to get the information from the Ministry of Home Affairs or some reputable ministry yes, so that you can get the inform correct information. These personality traits that will take you far if you try and develop them. If you are living in if you are living in any African continent you'll need this personality it's not that i'm perfect or something this is my opinion because i've lived here like all my life yes and i've noticed it helps it really helps the understanding because for example if you understand someone for example if you're in a restaurant and then this the the server who is serving you Maybe he or she has a different attitude or is dragging herself to, to serve you or to take anything, any order or anything. Don't try and judge the lady or the man because sometimes maybe the salary is too, salary is too low for, for him. Maybe he's stressed out. Another skill is patience. I'll talk about Kenya because I'm Kenyan. In Kenya, for example, if you go to a bank, there are longer queues for you to wait to have to have patience, yes, and persevere because sometimes you have to wait, yeah. And then because some of the bank tellers have slower, there's a beauty in that also cause for the for that movement because it new people. Yeah, with different backgrounds it, i love that because it really helps me grow also develop a thick skin because not everyone will be nice i tell you not everyone is nice not everyone will treat you like maybe for example if you are a foreigner not everyone will treat you the way maybe you expect to be treated yeah not everyone will be easily flattered yeah so, Nobody, not all are friendly, not all are comfortable with you. You have to be, to have a thick skin because you won't understand mostly what people are talking about or talking. But we are friendly, some of us are friendly. Another skill you need here in our motherland is confidence. Yes, confidence. There are many naysayers that you'll find some of them them who have their own fears of maybe, maybe coming to Africa or any, any other African countries. Some of them have their own fears. Maybe they say in Africa there is this and that. Yeah, you have to have confidence in that so that because there are many nice experiences you'll experience here different cultures, different 
places nice places we have here yeah so you guys there are phenomenal opportunities we'll find here in africa in our african continent yes you'll have to experience you'll experience them when you're here so if you have confidence and be open-minded to any chance you get here in, in our african continent the experience will be very very good so don't let the fear of others make you not come to africa you have to have to be open-minded because you run into situation where people where people do completely different things as to what you are used to so if you're open you're, you're op you'll, not, you'll learn great things here yeah the experience is here because maybe you'll find people love sharing food they can use one plate together so just be open and you'll enjoy here you'll really really enjoy i tell you the system maybe it's different from what you are used to also just be patient you will be shocked how it will go so guys the last the last skill that you need to make it in my motherland is independence yes yes independence what i mean by independence is that everything here in africa or in our in my motherland you will not find it laid out on a carpet you have to find it for yourself for example if you want to get a job you have to you have to push a little bit harder so that you can find the job if you want to start a business the same you have to push it harder not everything is convenience here in, in our african motherland but it also yields results i tell you guys that's the end of the video i hope you will like subscribe please don't forget to subscribe and comment down below your your other if you have any soft scale just write on the on my comment section yeah uh, and that is my opinion i love my motherland because it has helped me yield results I'm confident. I know I'm confident. I am patient. And I love that about my country. Because it has helped me a lot. Okay. If like to support channel, I'll write the link down below on my description box. And I've made it easier now. You just, you, you just click on the link. Thank you. Love you. Don't worry, today I'm mumbling, I'm bored. My sisters have left to Nairobi. Yeah, with my mom. 